We finally unwrapped the largest present we have ever received. If you're a surfer, or in my case, a wannabe surfer, you gotta visit Kata Beach while you're in Phuket. Along the way to Kata, we stop at Karen Beach Overlook, which is an absolute stunning view right above Kata Beach, and in the distance you can see Patong Beach as well. So we found this really amazing surf shop in Rawai. Hopefully I'm pronouncing that correctly. It's called the Green Room Surf Shop. If you're in the neighborhood, you gotta stop by. Really, really cool surf shop. So I like that one. Huh? Yeah, it's Kata Beach is the second most popular beach on Phuket. It is just south of the most popular beach on Phuket, which is Patong. But that is where the similarities between the two stops. Patong is the heavy party beach with a nightlife more like Las Vegas or Macau. Kata is more chill with a more local surfer type vibe, even though it is a heavy tourist destination beach. Like most of the beaches on Phuket, Kata is a world-class beach with near-perfect sand on both the beach and under your feet in the water. So this one is chicken. Is this spicy? Little. Little spicy. Oh.
chicken feet. Yeah. Wow, it looks yummy. So I order food here. Late because uh, Kyla eats so much. Garlic. Yeah, sure. Hey, yeah. Hey, here, I'll build that. Okay. The car is There are both restaurants and local vendors with street food on Kata. The food is really good and drastically more affordable than Patong Beach. <laughs> we got so much. <laughs> if you get a Filipina, fellas, this is what happens. This is why you need a Philippine girlfriend. They won't let you do anything. I tried to. It's not like I'm being lazy. I actually tried to wax the board. She just wouldn't let me. She's like, give me that. I'll do it. Give me that. I want to do it. So if you're a surfer and you're looking for a long-term girlfriend, get yourself a Filipina. And that's why I made her my wife. What are you doing, dude? <laughs> you up here? No, it's just a regular half inch. Like that? Yeah. Now that rope won't rip through the rail. You ready for surf?
We finally unwrapped the largest present we have ever received. So our big goal with YouTube is to use it as a means to help children and benefit our marine ecology and environment. The future of our planet is in taking care of both our children and the environment. We will be donating 100% of our YouTube revenues to charity and are used directly to benefit children and the environment wherever we travel to. <laughs> if you want to help us, it is super easy to help our cause and the best part is, it doesn't cost you anything. Mm -hmm. Simply like and share our videos on all social media and help us get our cause and journey out to other people. Liking our videos helps it get more exposure in YouTube to similar minded viewers. Sharing our videos across all social media platforms expands our reach for new viewers. Finally, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and watch as much of the video and ads as possible. Time viewed also helps us get more noticed on the YouTube platform. It also generates better revenues with advertisers. Thanks for watching everyone.